we're standing next to a very interesting place. This is the house of Dr. Israel Rudolf Kostner. And this, this sign says that he saved, he saved um, people during the Holocaust. In fact, there was a train with about 100 people. I'm not sure. But at the same time, a very famous um, Nazi, Rudolf Eichmann, who orchestrated the final solution, quote, I quote, said that thanks to Kastner, they managed the job. Thanks to Kastner's telling the Hungarian Jews uh, whom he was leading that nothing bad will happen to them, it was easy for the Nazis to organize them and, and, and uh, place them in a concentration camp. And these are the leaders of the left in Israel. And the left really doesn't care about people that don't have a lot of money. They only care about themselves. Socialism is gone and dead in Israel. And it's become a very, a, a party of privileged people um, that are fake. Because how can the granddaughter of a person like that who's so controversial and actually didn't save Jews, but he saved the wealthy Jews? And this is what socialism has become. And my late father always said, he says, what's mine is mine, and what's another person's is their other person. The whole idea of the kibbutz and people uh, sharing and communism is dead. Because it's, at the end of the day, it's become this uh, opportunity for people to take advantage of their powerful positions and do nothing for people that really are struggling financially. So therefore, I decided that this elections, I'm definitely going to vote for Benjamin Netanyahu because I want security and I don't want the fake um, stories of the left whose history uh, reveals them to not care about anybody but themselves and the wealthy.